The I Love First People shoebox campaign began just a few years ago and it's quickly become a national movement. People from all across the country are filling shoeboxes with educational gifts for First Nations children in northern communities to let them know that someone cares. Veronica Cooper has the details. Lynn Cole and her husband arrive home with a load of shoeboxes. Do you want to open up the garage? Which they will add to the pile of more than 400, all for the I Love First Peoples shoebox campaign. It's been rolling out since 2014, and we started the Victoria chapter on October 29th of this year. Lynn learned of the campaign to send educational gifts to children in northern communities on Facebook. And the closest chapter was in Vancouver, so I put my hand up and said, if you need a chapter coordinator in Victoria, I would be more than interested in, in supporting this. So what should boxes be filled with? They fill it with those items that support education. So you saw books, art, art supplies, musical instruments, some hy a hygiene item, and a really a beautiful note of encouragement. And I was really moved into action from Gore Downey's call for, for reconciliation action to make, um, to do something. These are pretty good. And Lynn has moved oh, yeah, many good... others to action, like these Victoria High School students. Throughout all of high school, we've learned a lot about reconciliation efforts for Aboriginal people, and I think this is a great way to try and do what we can to, to give back. The kids loved the idea that it was helping people in Canada, helping kids, and it was an initiative that would support education. It's looking good. The shoe boxes are collected in December, sorted in January, and delivered in the spring. The boxes that we collect in British Columbia go to British Columbia communities. We have eight identified north of Smithers that have shown interest and have partnered for a long-term commitment with I Love First Peoples. We learn about residential schools in school, and um, we really just want to help bring back happiness to the people that were hurt in the past. This is a grassroots movement that allows Canadians, Indigenous or non-Indigenous, to partner together to make a change that's tangible. And it, it's, it's one step of the conversation. Learn more at the links tab on our website. Vital People is brought to you in part by the Victoria Foundation. Connecting people who care with causes that matter.